I'll show you how I do how I do the apocalypse challenge. Um okay, so we gotta do this way, go to presets, do apocalypse three, apply. So this is how I do the apocalypse challenge. So when we grab that, we grab that, we grab that. Um, actually, I grab two. So I grab two smudge six and a parabolic. I look at the objectives. So we got an escape a hunt. Good. Parabolic. Good. Motion sensor. Actually, all three objectives are actually pretty good. Um, I grabbed two smudge sticks purely for the simple fact of, okay, I don't know why I grabbed the headlamp because flashlights don't work. Oh, thank you. And there you go. So basically what you do is you come in. Yeah. Lights don't work. So you come in, go actually go this side. This side's better. Goes, you get that break line of sight, then you get this break line of sight. Oh shit, Ghost is here somewhere. I heard it. But you kind of move hiding spot, hiding spot to hiding spot. But you sit here and you kind of wait around. See if you can hear the ghost. Though, technically, I would probably go find a better hiding spot. Best hiding spot you can go to? Oh no, you're here. Oh, that sucks. Okay, so life sucks. Um, okay, we need to wait for a hunt. Either ghost teleported to me or it's uh <laughs> or it's here. Rose Gaming. Th oh thank you. I feel like a pretty princess. So now you listen. I mean, to be totally honest, I kind of got best case scenario. You want the ghost there. <laughs> that makes it way easier. The only problem is it sounds like a normal speed ghost. Normal speeds, normal speed ghosts suck for this challenge. Yeah. Ghost is 125. So your normal speed ghosts kind of suck for this challenge. <laughs> Cause what you're looking for is either like a revenant, which is going to sound normal. Or you want like the Fascos, like Diosian, Maroy, Thay. You want something like that. <laughs> you want to try to get your picture near the stairwell so you can run down the stairs. Um... Right now, probably you kind of, you kind of want to set up. Oh, it never saw me. Okay. Um, so getting crucifixes in there isn't a bad deal. I should have recorded this. It's been a while since I've actually seen that since I've done a apocalypse. Here's the only, here's the only problem with the ghost being in the foyer. In reality, you probably want the ghost to be either in that room or that room or the chapel. Because in the foyer, this is your first good hiding spots are here, and the ghost is probably going to go to you there. 
Let's do this. That down. Let's grab that. And you want to walk around the crucifix because gold, uh, gold apocalypse shit. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shoot. Okay, so Ghost is either going to be Wraith, Phantom, or Banshee. Because it teleported to us. I mean, it either walked to us in the beginning, or it teleported to us. Because it's not here anymore. <laughs> Crap. But Wolfata, thank you very much for the follow. Hope you're having a good day. Okay, that's okay. Where's my parabolic at? So this is why you bring the parabolic in. So you grab the parabolic. And you listen. And you try to find the ghost. See if, uh, still got lights. Okay. Uh... Unless it's a Yuri. But I didn't hear an event. All right, so let's grab camera. Wait, what else do we wait? What else do we have? We need. We got an escape. We need motion sensor. So let's grab a motion sensor. We'll put a motion sensor at the double doors. You're not going to get evidence, but what you can get is if it's a Wraith, you're not going to get an EMF five on a teleport, but you will get an EMF two. So we'll bring this in. We'll see if we get another teleport. Okay. It's nearby. If it comes all the way down, we're dead. Because we will never be able to outrun it to uh, to a hiding spot. And why you want to go to this side instead of that side? Because the desk blocks your line of sight from the doors. So you come over here and you can check the light and get back in there. Where if the ghost, let's say the ghost is coming up from the chapel or coming up from downstairs, that desk will break line of sight so it doesn't see you. There is a bunch of little tricks with this, with the, uh, with this. Sniffno, how you doing? I like my Tierra. Thank you. But yeah, I will be wearing the tiara all week. So I'll be wearing it till next uh next Thursday. I'll be wearing it through next Thursday. That's for getting me to 300 subs last uh last month. But I will say right now for Apocalypse Challenge, if your ghost is in one of the wings, downstairs, I want to hide there.
So it definitely teleported. So it either walked to us or it teleported. So, okay, so let's set up here. Go there. Go there. Oh, yeah, I never did that. Well, they, uh, Nike asked me to do a, do the apocalypse challenge. So I was like, yeah, what the hell? We can do it. I can show how I do it. But the thing is, because it teleported or walked to us the first time is the only reason why I'm staying with this. Normally, I would have left by now. Yeah, I'm doing gold APOC. Because if the ghost is in the wings, you're walking at 50% chance. It's going at 125% chance. The chances of you... It's not that you can't survive, because you can. The amount of time you're wasting that you could be spending on the next game is the big thing. At least for me. But since I think this ghost is either a Banshee or a... Banshee, Phantom, or Wraith. I'm kind of sticking with it. But if I thought this ghost... But because we know it's a normal speed ghost... If I thought this ghost was any other ghost... Other than those three... I would have bailed already. And I learned this lesson by doing silver. <laughs> when I did silver, I was walking to every... Wherever the ghost was, that's where I went. And I would spend 45 minutes walking back and forth, surviving. And then I'd get down to 50, 50, 90, and I'd guess the wrong ghost. And I finally was like, okay, no more. When I got the gold, it was like, no, we walk in. If we don't have good objectives, we walk the hell out. We just reset. All right, so we got that. We got that. We already got an EMF down there. We can grab that. All right. Honestly, this, cha this challenge drives me insane. But walking... Everything with this challenge, I am fine with, except this. I hate walking this slow. <laughs> walking this slow drives me insane. I mean, if I had sprint, I'd be okay. I, I could deal with it. Barely, but I could deal with it. Because I don't have sprint, yeah, it sucks. The problem is, is... We had the ghost in the beginning. We actually had the ghost in the beginning and we got hunted in the beginning from the lobby. But now it's been doing everything down there. So. All right. So we got our EMF out. We got these. Just drop that. <laughs> I mean, the last hunt came from all the way down here. There it is. I hear it. Now it started at that end. What the hell? This ghost is going everywhere. Gaming tube, hello. This ghost is every freaking where. Yeah, that's not Hantu speed. I saw my breath. So, so far, I've been hunted in the foyer. I've been hunted from over here. 
Unless the ghost... Eh, it could have been. Maybe the ghost was... Maybe the ghost started here and then ran that way. Maybe. Uh, it can't be a Gorio. It's changed too many rooms. Oh, trip the bush sensor. I need to get a photo. I need to, I need to get a photo. I need to get a guess. Found it. Okay. So let's go grab crucifix. Any tips on how to get better? Just got the game recently. Um, do the tutorial until you get until the gear, until the tier one gear feels comfortable. Um, I, the tier one gear makes this game so much harder. <laughs> Not gonna lie, this game is so much harder with tier one gear. Uh, after you get the tier, once you get to tier two, it definitely becomes a lot easier. What else do I have? I got two of these. Uh, actually, that's a small enough room for one. But but do the tutorial until you feel comfortable with the gear. Do amateur until... Basically, do amateur until you get bored. Once you get bored, go to intermediate. Once you get bored of intermediate, go to professional. And then from there, do whatever. Um, when you first go in the house, every time you pass a locker or closet... Take a look. See if you've got... Uh, see if you've got... Um, see if it's an open... Sorry. I'm trying to concentrate and try to think at the same time. <laughs> see if the locker or closet is open. Those are probably, and then the other thing I would say is when you know where the ghost is, make sure, make sure you know where your escape routes are. So for me, I know that is where, that is where I want to go. So I'll try to make sure that the ghost does not block me off. Any to uh, that's why I say max 15 meters. Uh, what are we talking about here? What are we talking about here? Yeah, it started upstairs also. It actually did an event right off the bat upstairs in the foyer and then did a hunt. I heard it. I thought I heard it in here. Okay, it would actually probably be better to... Why am I not being hunted? There's no way this goes to the shade. All right, no arguing. All right, calm down, people. Phantom, ha-ha! <laughs> All right, we got everything. Oh, actually, we don't have everything, but we know what the ghost is. I don't believe I'm actually going to get this. I'm getting gold on my first try. ha 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 ha
This guy didn't escape. I've got two smudge sticks. I got a bookcase. It's a one star. It already got crossed off. Oh, actually, no, it didn't get crossed off. Buddy, you are in the way and I can't see shit. No, 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 shit, god damn it. Oh, that was almost stupid. Ooh. Oh my god. Buddy, can you move, please? Go. Go. Oh, I can't believe I almost killed myself. I'm used to be... It's harder to do that when you're slow. That slide move. <laughs> okay, let's get the hell out of here. You guys get a free guess. Walk faster. Oh, I'm so freaking worried that this ghost is following me. And just waiting for the smudge stick to end. I did not do that intentionally. <laughs> It's just in regular mo in normal speed, it's a very easy slide and you're out of the way. And when you're moving 50% speed, yeah, that's not a fast slide. Why would I say I did that on purpose? <laughs> then it's fake. Then I just faked. Okay. You need to go. All right. How much money do we get? Ooh, looky there, everybody. So, yeah. Also, by the way, if you do gold, if you get gold, you get all three. 